Oh, what's up, Brawl fam? Today, we're over here at Target, and we're in the toy section. If you guys look right here, there is so many cool, crazy-looking toys that honestly could help me feed some of my massive predator fish. Honestly, if you guys come over here, I found something that I think would be an amazing candidate for a crazy, exciting adventure, right? This little thing right here is actually a Nerf Roblox blaster, and I honestly think if we were to attach, like, a little fishing reel or something right here and shot our baits into like the water oh we could easily catch some fish to feed to my massive predators let's get out of here buy this thing all right guys what's the grand total and what is it 33.69 right there all right looks like we got to catch 40 dollars worth of fish it's all gonna happen right now so we just got back over to the raw fam and we have our nerf roblox like shark blaster we're actually gonna open this bad boy up right now so and we got our whoa our blasters right there now this little thing i believe can shoot really far but the, oh the ammo's right here so look at this come close and as you can see i guess this is like the little shark bullet right there we're gonna put it inside of our blaster and i guess now we just gotta look for a, oh there, there's a target right there there's a target right there ready three two oh oh we got one come on guys we got one oh there we go guys and that is our catch we got a big one i'm gonna release him <gasps> you okay buddy so of course guys we're gonna be turning this little roblox nerf blaster right here into an epic fishing nerf blaster three times my lucky charm i gotta get him Oh, got him. Boom, baby. And that's exactly what we're going to do, too. Some massive bait fish. We need to go into South Florida waterway somewhere. We need to target and find some colorful fish, capture those fish, and feed them to the predator pond and all of the other predators that we have at the Raw Fam. And we need to build this thing. So let's go to the table and do this thing. Woo! So we have two bullets and we also have this little blaster. My idea for the build, come close. I need to actually get a fishing rod for the top of this little blaster. And while we were at Walmart, we actually found the perfect fishing rod for the job. So you all know, we went off and we got a blue Nerf blaster. Now we just need a fishing rod for it. And I think I know exactly what we need. This right here is actually a blue fishing rod. All right, we got the fishing rod, we got the blaster. Let's get back to the Raw fam and build this epic like fishing machine. Let's Let's do it. It's right here. We already unlocked it, but you see this? Look look back here. See this little issue right here? See the stem right here? The actual handle to the rod? And if we glue this thing in, whenever the bullet's supposed to shoot out, it's gonna hit into the rod. So we have to cut this off so that the angle is tilted upwards so that our little bullet right here just goes phew along with our fishing line, bait, and hook. All right, our task for right now, we gotta cut this little handle off and turn this thing into a DIY fish blaster. It's gonna happen right now. How the? How the heck do I do? Ah! Oh, oh. This thing is full blast. And now we gotta cut this little handle off just like that. Ah! <laughs> Camera almost gotcha. <laughs> and if, I, if I'm correct, it might be able to, to pop off just like that, Raw fam. Look at that. So this, we don't need it no more. Oh, oh. Sorry, Bill. My neighbors love me. And now we can easily attach this fishing blaster right there. And there's gonna be no snag ups when we shoot a big old lure. So next for what we have to do, we're actually gonna take this little rod and reel. We're actually gonna mount it here using hot glue. Guys, this stuff is scolding hot. So be very careful. But we do not want the rest of this little blaster to poke out. So we just need to take our hot glue like that. And we need to secure this down and fasten it to our little blaster. That is perfect just like that we're gonna do the front a little bit all right i just need a little bit more hot glue to finish the builds we got extra hot glue now that is perfect right there probably one of the coolest diy blasters i've ever built this right here is your nerf gun fishing blaster shark edition this thing specializes in catching apex predators and i think this thing's almost ready to go there's only one or two more adjustments we have to make before we can even test it as of now all it is is a gun with a fishing rod attached and uh, there's no way that our, our bullet actually shoots out to where we could retrieve it so we need to somehow do something to where the line attaches to the bullet so that when we cast it we could actually fish good thing it's winter because this right here is the s'more maker 5000 it's a little metal stick all we have to do is put that little metal stick right there go oh perfect right there now make the hole nice and big for us 
and voila, magnificent. All we're gonna do is take our fishing line, put it right at the tip of our little metal thing, and then just push the line right through. Bada boom, bada bang. We just bridled our little uh, Nerf lure, and now our fishing line is attached to the little bullet. But wait, how the heck are we gonna catch a fish? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. We need to put a fishing hook attached to our little lure. So we just need a hook. Oh, here we go. Literally perfect, what the heck? All right, so we're gonna go in through the hook. Tie the hook on with your best fishing knot. Mm, perfect. This right here is our Nerf Roblox Fishing Blaster. That is a custom DIY project. We got the bullet right here, and all you have to do is put that little bullet right on there. Then you follow the fishing line back. Now it's ready. You're gonna click this little bail right here. Click, and then obviously put your bait of choice on there. I'm gonna put this uh, little piece of the glue, and I don't want the barb to be sticking out because because my fish will eat it. We got the hook not there. All right, come on. Oh, fishes! Are you guys ready to catch some fish? In three, two, one. Come on, Nerf Fishing Blaster. Oh, oh, that's perfect. And then if I wanna reel it in, Bada boom, bada bang. Bro, this is so epic. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I will make sure that if it isn't in this video, we will catch a fish bigger than the Nerf Fishing Blaster right here. 1,000% from this side of the Nerf Blaster all the way to this side. All right, we're gonna put our little uh, bullet in there right here. Click the bell. Hey Jack, you ready to fish, buddy? <laughs> if he was a fish, he would've ate the bait. Oh, I, I, I think I might. Oh, I got him! Get over here, Jackie, we got one! <laughs> That is exactly how it's gonna happen in the wild. All right guys, so our Roblox fishing blaster right here is ready to go. I'll see you guys at the fishing spot. So, I'll see you there. What's up guys, so it's the next morning. We just got over here to like a little uh, dock or whatever, and there's this amazing cool lady here doing fish trap. Come here, and she's got one off this side over here just with bread. Look at all the fish that are everywhere. And look, she said I could bring this one out. Look at this. Look how many baits are in there. There's like a whole bunch of little bluegills right there. And she says she catches them and she uses them as bait to catch bigger fish, and I think that's totally cool. So these fish traps clearly work. They're, they're really good, and uh, today we're going to be uh, chumming up some bread to hopefully catch some massive fish on. Where's it, where's it? Oh, okay, on the Nerf Roblox fishing blaster right here. We're gonna catch some massive fish. It's gonna happen right now, so come on. All right guys, so I have this little raw fishing bucket, and I just need to get a little bit of water. This right here is an aerator. You're actually gonna turn it on, and this is gonna provide dissolved oxygen to all your bait fish. It's actually putting air down at the bottom of the bucket and bringing it up, and the moment that the water goes from the bottom to the top, it's touching the air, it's actually dissolving, it's creating dissolved oxygen. All right, so get a piece of bread. Now come down here. We're just gonna take the bread, put it under the water, and soak it. So you're gonna take it. Now it's really like soft and mushy. See how like easy it'll just like wiggle like that? Now, all you have to do is just take this bread. It's gonna dissolve as soon as it hits the water. And that is how you chum the water. So, we're ready to fish. We just chum the water. We have our little blaster right here. And all the bait actually went underneath the dock. And uh, I think we had a couple fish come up. You see them all? We have our little blaster. And we're gonna go. Uh, oh, oh, they're all on it. Look at all the fish, bro. Look at all the fish. Got him, got him. That's exactly what I'm talking about, baby. So, we just got our first little baby bait right there, cast to catch. This right here is a bluegill, and this is exactly what we need to start feeding all the predators at the Raw Fam. Our snake, our monitor, our massive bass, even our tortoises could eat something like this. We're actually gonna take this little booger, put him inside of the bucket, and guys, we probably, well, we need probably like 10, 15 of these little boogers. We're gonna be catching them, literally, like, what was that, like our second cast? Every single time the bait hits the water, boom, they're on. So, let's catch a couple more. All right, here we go. Oh, whoop. Come on, fish. Let's go. You got one. Huh? I think you got one. <laughs> you consider that one? This is what we were trying not to catch. These are the little babies. Oh, no. Okay. Sorry, buddy. Throw them back. Yep. Bye, Nemo. Guys, we need to find a couple fish that are uh, just a tad bit bigger. Jack. Bait me up, buddy. We're literally using a bread ball that is just the size of the tip of the hook. All right, I'm gonna show you how this thing's working right now. Whoa. See it? Better zoom. I'm setting immediately. Got him. Got him. Just like that. <laughs> One and done, baby. So, if you want a little bit bigger of fish, you gotta barely put it on the tip of the hook. Apparently, that's exactly how it goes. Look at that little, look at that little baby. He's 
so pretty. This is the perfect size that we need for today's adventure in Aslasta Vista, baby. <laughs> we got two fish inside of the bucket. We're gonna try and get another one on video for you guys, and then at that point, it's pretty much tedious. Then we're just gonna probably have a bunch. All right, bait me up, buddy. Oh my goodness, I'm trying to make the world's smallest bread ball. Can you even zoom in on that? The thing is so small. All right, I'm gonna put it on the tip of the hook, just like that. All right, let's do it. Bada boom. Jack, give me some bait. Oh, the chum right there. Oh, they're all over my bait. They're all over my bait. Come on. Come on. Oh, the big ones are coming in too. Oh, I'm on. Come on, he pulled drag, he pulled drag. Let's go, baby. And that is exactly what you gotta do. If you wanna catch big fish with the crew, you gotta use a boom, Roblox fishing blast right there, baby. Look at that, that is a perfect little bait fish right there for my little buddy, Baby Jaws, and Prime back at the Raw Fam. All right, so where's my bait, buddy? Oh, oh, crap, my bad, Jack. Oh, my bad, Did, didn't mean to do that. Or, or maybe I did, and here you come, come right here. Oh. Right in the bucket she goes. All right guys, so this spot is completely over. All the fish are nice and full, so we're actually gonna take our little blaster, try out another spot, and uh, hopefully we have enough baits to actually catch some massive fish. I wanna catch something bigger than this blaster. I don't know if it's gonna happen today, but if we get three likes on today's video, I will try again and uh, hopefully catch something bigger than this little thing. Come on guys, let's get out of here. All right guys, so we just got done fishing. We have our Roblox shark blast right here, and we actually had a really successful day. If you guys look inside of this bucket, I know they're not the biggest but we caught a bunch of little like bluegills that are gonna be the best bait fish for obviously prime speed the bass and baby jaws back at the raw fam we also have a couple really small tarpon that will love to eat some of these boogers so we're actually gonna go back take a little break from fishing feed everything and then I have an amazing fishing spot that we're gonna catch some massive canal whales let's do it shotgun all right guys so we just got back over to the raw fam and we're over here at this little cooler we have all the baits can I do it is that cool I'm just gonna do one or two and then I'm gonna let Jack do the rest so you're just gonna scoop here look at all the baits that we caught today now a lot of these also are from that really cool nice lady with a fish trap oh and look what else she caught she caught a cichlid right there see that little cichlid I'm gonna put these in there now, not all of these are actually gonna get fed right now. Some of them are gonna get fed, and then a lot of them are also going to go into a like quarantine zone. We're actually gonna treat them for parasites, and then we're gonna start bulking them up and start feeding them so then they get bigger. I got two baits, and I got two beautiful tarpon that are really hungry. Come on. All right, guys, so we had to take a little break from fishing because, you know, obviously all the fishies are hungry, and I really want you guys to be able to see our brand new Indo Pacific tarpon come up and eat, and now. It's time for them to shine. All right, come here. I got a couple bluegill in here, and we got a couple really, really, really small bluegill from that lady that made that fish trap. All right, so now we're gonna, act. can you see those tarpon right there? Can you see them? Yeah. Oh, tarpon time, he ate it, he ate it. You saw that, bro? Let's go! <laughs> I love these tarpon, bro, they're so cool. He missed it. All right, guys, so we have our little bluegill right here, and we have a couple tarpon, but I'm gonna throw this bait right here. Watch that. Oh, oh, bass are fighting over it right there. Oh, did you get that? I, I know you guys got, I know you got that. But guys, we actually have a couple baits left in here that uh, that we're actually gonna go off and feed to obviously prime and speed the bass over in the mega pond. So let's go over here, come on. Oh my gosh, wait, did I update everybody on how good this pond looks? Guys, come here. You, as you guys can see, all of the koi fish that are actually in here are doing amazing. This is the aftermath of the last video whenever we actually had to go off and you know get all of the fish out of the pond. Well, they're back in the pond now. Hi. I'm actually gonna feed them. All right guys, so we have a little bit of pebbles. Watch, they're gonna come up in right now. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Always the chick always, bro. So this is what you have to do. You have to get all up in their face, all up in their business, and feed them. And uh, after about, I don't know, 30 days, they should be used to you. Camera, you might as well sit. Wait, are you fitting? Yeah. Look. Look at that turtle. See him? Oh, yeah. Basking. He got out of his enclosure, bro. He's fully alive. <laughs> Wake up. Are you basking? Go on. <laughs> you gonna swim, buddy? Um, this little guy got out of his enclosure. He's actually supposed to be over here. He's just so small that he can get through this little PVC pipe right here. And uh, good thing for us, they don't like going too far. Back in your enclosure. 
those soft shell turtles really aren't supposed to be basking like that so if you saw her shell it was like really really dry so they're supposed to stay in the water and honestly guys if you guys come down here and look inside of this little bucket. There is a beautiful little bait right here. This is the perfect little gumdrop. Look at this little go. Oh crap! No! Nemo! This little gumdrop right here is so perfect to obviously go feed to, you know, one of these fish. Zoom in right there. You see Speed the Bass right there? That is Speed the Bass on a nest right there. And oh, Speed's coming over. Speed's coming over. They know it's feeding time. You ready? Come on, Prime. Oh, oh, no, I didn't mean to let go. Come on. Oh, <laughs> that right there was speed the bass, everyone. These guys are honestly some of the craziest largemouth. Oh, <laughs> speed hits again, baby. All right, Raw fam, that was obviously going off and speeding prime and speed the bass. But we have a couple extra little baits right here, and we all know what we do with the extra baits. Come on, I'm gonna dump these guys in. And whenever it's a rainy day and we have a really bad fishing adventure where we try some crazy thing that, that just didn't work, we come right back over to this pond, we take one net full, and we're able to feed all the crazy predators at the Raw Fam. All right, so uh, I did promise you guys that we're gonna attempt to catch something massive in this video, so let's get out of here and go try that. <laughs> oh, y'all are videoing? <laughs> Tell me that ain't fun. All right, you gotta reward him. Woo! <laughs> Got him! Sorry guys, I like playing that little game with them where my hand is the bait fish and they go, ow! <laughs> Literally all right here. Yeah, the school's right there, the school's right there. Get down, get down. They see us, we're done. Back up, back, back up there. See him under it? Did you see that? Did you see that? Come on. If the bobber's too big for him, you can try and fight it. Oh crap. Oh crap. Relax, relax. See, the bobber is so big that that actually set the hook on him. He's trying to, but the bobber set the hook, and it's such a big bobber, he no longer wants to fight. Let's go. Yeah, Jack, give me some buddy. Let's freaking go. Let's go. Bro, we've literally been after fish, trying every single spot from here to freaking Miami. And we finally got a perfect hook set right here. Look at this, right in the top of the mouth right here. So as you guys can see, we've been working our freaking butt off. This fish is about half. I mean, he's almost as big as the blaster right there. But guys, we finally caught the massive fish that we need to actually complete today's challenge. This fish right here is, what, probably almost like 15 inches, bro? Right, uh, just, about. Just, just about 15 inches. We've been trying all day. Come right here, I wanna get the hook out. Look at that, that hook was not going anywhere. What happened was is that we actually casted it over there and then we were sitting there for so long that it just drifted and then he came up out of nowhere and just said thank you and i was like film film <laughs> but guys we got today's challenge freaking done this right here is our nerf roblox shark blast right here fishing edition this is a diy about about as yeah oh jeez this thing right here is about as DIY as it gets. We got a beautiful little fishy right there, and hey, we're gonna bring this back as a as a palm pet. Come. All right, guys, so we just got this beautiful blue tilapia right here. Jack, how big do you think blue tilapia get? Maybe like 12, 15 pounds? Yeah, probably. These guys are freaking epic, and I'm actually gonna throw this guy inside. And to keep it easy for everybody to know, I'm gonna name this guy right off the bat. What, what do you think we're gonna name her? Blue? Oh! Oh, you're so smart, bro. That's gonna be blue, aka the blue tilapia. So let's get this beautiful girl back to the raw fam, but hold on. Look at the bubbler. I'm gonna turn the bubbler on. <laughs> Subscribe. Oh, that was the bubble box, bro. That wasn't me. So guys, this is our beautiful new fish, Blue. She's got a big old belly right there from eating. Guys, we actually have to get out of here, go back to the predator pond, introduce Blue to all of her new brothers and sisters. And I think I gotta get a high five from Jacaranda right there, boom. Now, let's get back to the raw fam. Bam! All right, guys, so I'm gonna scoop up the fish out of the cooler. Oh, blue. All right, let's get her over to that fresh, clean water. Right there. All right, I'm gonna just let this fish sit right here for a second. All right, guys, so we're actually over here at the predator pond. Come down here. We have blue. Oh, relax there, blue. Look at the purple. See the purple coming through right there? There's like a, an essence of purple coming off of blue. Now, this is our brand new blue tilapia blue. These guys are totally gorgeous, and these guys will get very big. Go look at Blue. Go on, Blue. 
<laughs> this right here is our Nerf Roblox Mega Blaster. It was 100% a success. And of course, if you guys like to support the channel, guys, go to the link in the description or click down below because all the merch is linked down below. Because this Roblox Mega Fishing Blaster right here with a uh, custom DIY fishing reel attached to it that obviously caught a massive fish. I mean, if you guys like this stuff, make sure you like the video. Trust me, it helps us out. Picking more videos for you guys to enjoy. And we had such a fun time. Jack, thanks so much for being in the video. I'll see you later, buddy. Oh, I just set him up there. Hey, Jack. Oh, oh we got him. Come on, guys. Let's get this one. Ah, I love you all, fam. And I'll see you later. Bye.